Good morning. Here I am running 12 miles. Happy New Year. You'll notice that I'm by myself today. Ray has to work today. And then I have to work tomorrow in Santa Barbara. So he's gonna get to run in Santa Barbara and he'll film a little bit tomorrow. So this will be great. Um, Happy New Year. We went to the Rose Parade as usual and it was a lot of fun. Um, I haven't really thought about what I was gonna say, except I wanna tell you something else. Yesterday I explored Charlie Chaplin's hotel in Montecito where I work. Montecito is like a small part of Santa Barbara. And I made a little film of the awesome elevator in there. So here it is. Oh my goodness, I'm in Charlie Chaplin's hotel and look at this elevator. You go into it like this and then you have to, look, look at these old dials. And then you have to slide this open and then you open a door. Many years ago, this used to be a, a dirt path, but now they've paved it. So I guess enough people have come through here that they paved it. So I'm almost to five miles now. Feet's still going strong. I gotta show you guys, this is where I went to kindergarten. Right back there is my kindergarten. So I have lived here all my life. Um, it's a little, I think it's like, a, ba a little Baptist kindergarten, a little Christian kindergarten that I went to school right there. And the playground is right there. I mean, it has new equipment and stuff, but that's where I played when I was in kindergarten. Little would I know that, you know, all these years later, 30 years later, more than that, I would be running to the end of the pier and back from my house barefoot. I am living the dream. So this is where a scene from Back to the Future was actually filmed. I can't remember which one. It's the one that has the magic train and then the car that goes up into the air. This is the very spot that that is filmed. Very cool, right? In my backyard, practically. And another scene is filmed in my neighborhood. Look where I made it to. I made it to the pier. And I'm gonna run all the way out to the end of the pier. Hey, so I made it to the end of the pier. This is almost six miles out from my house. And now I get to run back six miles, but this is very cool to be here. And I saw a surfer over there. There's really no waves right today. There are some nice swells, but this is the kind of uh, ocean conditions I would like to go out on for my first surfing expedition. I've been watching YouTube videos, studying the waves um, and learning how to read the ocean because I'm very interested in learning how to surf. So here I am on the end of the pier and time to run back home. Hi YouTube, I am running in Santa Barbara and it's awesome right now, it's not too hot, not too cold, my distance is 12 miles, I just started running, hey look there's a barefoot person in front of me, maybe I'll catch up to her right now, I can show you guys, so I don't know where this path is gonna lead, but I'm hoping I can get six miles one way and then six miles back. And as you can see, my my partner's out with me. She's she's busy working right now, actually. It's funny, because I worked yesterday. Uh, and she ran yesterday. But there you go, there's, there's the barefoot lady. Okay, so. I will film some more later. Take care. So look how, look how beautiful it is over here.
That's the beach in Santa Barbara, California. Pausing workout. Look at these palm trees too. Nice. And then the ocean. And then you can see the mountain range over there. It's a little overcast, but it, overall it's beautiful. It's nice. The air is nice and clean. This looks like a familiar scene in Santa Barbara. Look at it. It's like the marina in Oxnard. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. And I'm running with shoes because I don't know where I'm running. Here's another nice white area of Santa Barbara. I think Santa Barbara City College is back there. And there's a hill coming. <laughs> Gotta go up that hill. Look at this section of the coastline. Beautiful little park by the ocean. It's nice. It's a beautiful run. I'm hoping I can get six miles that way and then I can get six miles back so I can complete 12 miles so talk to you guys later Bye. yeah guys so I just want to say that running without a partner is pretty hard pretty difficult especially on long runs so as you can see my partner's not here because she's actually she's working today's Sunday I worked yesterday and she ran yesterday without me. So I just want to tell her that I love her and I miss her. And it's it's so hard to run without her. I feel like quitting, but I know I can't because this is marathon training. This is uh, our, our uh, 12 mile weekend. So I gotta, I gotta put in 12 miles. Right now I'm around, let's see, I think I'm at mile four. So, um, so anyway, take a look at this beautiful, beautiful scene here. Awesome. So I'll talk to you later. So as you could see, I had to go into a neighborhood because I ran out of coastline. Uh, basically, it's just the same straight path. I didn't have to turn right or anything. Just keep going straight. I'm just hoping I can get another two miles up ahead. But as you could see, It's just neighborhood over here. Going up this hill. Pausing workout. Woo. Just wanted to show you guys. This is uh, mile five. Pausing it's workout. It's hard because it's hilly. It's a hill. Let me turn around. Look at back there. It's nothing but hills. So pretty hard. I'm almost at the halfway point. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Okay. Now I'm, uh, I'm going on the return. I hit six miles up there. And I'm going back. And here's the view. Talk to you later. This is super nice. I'm like at mile 11 right now. Check it out. Yeah. But it's, I don't know why it's so hard. I feel like quitting, but anyway, see you guys. So we're back together again. And Ray finished his 12 mile run. Mm -hmm. And I finished Amen. work. How was your it run? It was awesome. Mm -hmm. It was doable, but it was a little hard because it was kind of hilly. Mm -hmm. Nice hills. 
elevation was like 500 feet on one of them. So oh, that's it looked, a lot. It looked easy, <laughs> but it was actually, yeah, you need to practice. I, I need to practice, so I was, you know, got to practice more hill running. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, because the LA Marathon has a lot mm -hmm. of hill hills, so we're mm -hmm. going to have to really practice on the hills. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. But it was fun. It was cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, beautiful scene out there. A lot of people running and people on bicycles and just people having a good time by the pier, by the ocean by the beach mm -hmm. yeah a lot of tourists yeah nice nice new running path yeah i want to run there mm -hmm. now mm -hmm. all right so that's it have a great day have a great day